where Ethan Hughes, talk, talk us through that win, how was it out there? Yeah, it was great. Uh, the boys really gelled together as um, obviously Dave Mundy's 300. So, you know, it's a little bit extra incentive for us to, you know, dig in a little bit more. But we stuck to our systems that we've been through all year and, you know, we got over the line in the end. Is that one of the first big milestone games you've played in? Oh, I've played in a couple, but, you know, 300 is a great achievement. You know, you've got to be you've got to be a great player for a long time and Dave's that. So, you know, we've put our heads down and we've got the result. And he was probably the player who lifted us, especially in that third term when it was really tight. Yeah, we we'll struggled a little bit in the midfield and uh, we needed a bit of a lift and Dave was the one who came over the top and helped us get going forward. The Bulldogs really came to play, didn't they? They did, definitely. It was, um, you know, it was never an easy game in the AFL, so once the, we got on top, we sort of we cruised on a little bit and then you know, our hard work over the summer builds up and we've uh, put a four-quarter effort in. Talk us to Yoda, how do you feel you went out there today? Yeah, I, was, I went all right. You know, the, the back six of us, we all gelled together. So, you know, Nyhouse coming to the side, he's you know, played his role, he's played it down in the waffle. You know, we've got trust in him that anyone can come in the side and play their role. And he's, you know, a great example of that today that he's, you know, fitted straight in. Must make it easy for you with guys like Joel Hamley and Alex Pierce as well down back. Definitely, they're big guys. So they're, they're the pillar of the defence and we just work around them and, you know, hopefully we can get it going forward. You played five games last year. That must have been a bit frustrating for you, but now you've come in and you've played every game so far this year. How does it feel to break back into that 22? Yeah, it was definitely a tough year last year, but you know, I've assessed where I was at and I've put my head down over summer and you know, it was a long four months over the pre-season where I've, you know, I've got a lot of work to do. So I've, I feel like I've put that in and you know, six games so far this year and I'm only looking forward from here. Was there anything that was highlighted that you worked on or where you feel like you've improved? Um, just my team aspect of the way I needed to fit into the team and then obviously my personal skills of what I need to improve on. So that's just what I put my head down and then you know the hard work on top of that. You know, it's not an easy job so we've, I've done the extra work and then you know it's looking like it's working for me so far. You and Ryan Nyhouse led for, for intercepts. It must be good for you two to be able to read the play. Yeah, definitely. You know, share the ball around a little bit so it was, yeah, it was definitely a good game. A uh, tough game next week against the Crows wrapping about. Yeah, uh, I'm not sure how they went today, but um, you know we're always looking forward. So we'll get to work, we'll get to training, and we'll review this game, and then we'll move on quickly to next week. Cheers, well played, thank you. Thank you.